Hey friends, I'd love to share with you um, what I've come up with for my corporate values. So there's three of them and they're designed to work and balance each other. And over the next few days or coming weeks, I'll be posting little short videos and stories about what they each mean, how they show up and uh, how they work together. So integrity, efficiency and love. So integrity for me shows up so much. It first came up in a LinkedIn review a long time ago when I was first starting out as a project manager and this super senior PM that I was working with at a giant uh, Fortune 500 company in, uh, in the States left a review on my LinkedIn and said, picked integrity as my, my key value. And I thought, wow, that's, I hadn't thought, of, I hadn't thought about that before. However, she kind of had a point. Integrity for me shows up in terms of making sure that we're doing the right work. Um, if the project isn't working, it's good to talk about that. It's good to flag things. We're not like ostrich with our head in their sand. We, we need to be honest, we need to be transparent. And this is something that shows up for me in every aspect of my life, especially since I started um, living it as a, as a working value as well. Then we have efficiency. Um, efficiency potentially is, uh, it's like integrity and love are balancing out my efficiency. Um, I'm spreadsheets. <laughs> I love to organize things. I'm really good to take on a road trip because I'm going to uh, be your navigator and find us the fastest way there with the least stops or whatever we need. I mean, give me something to design that's efficient and oh my God, I just, uh, I really come alive. However, Efficiency on its own can lead me to become a little bit of a robot where people uh, may be giving feedback or, you know, wanting to do the right thing, integrity, or having feelings, love. And if, if, if I'm just living efficiency, it's just like pff, railroad train coming through. Um, let's get this done. <laughs> yeah. So the, the third value, and definitely it's one of those last but not least, is love. And this has been uh, very interesting to live love as a corporate business value. Love is the root of, of compassion, of empathy, of wanting to check in with the team, of wanting to know how, how people are feeling. And this is something that um, I'll link to my love project uh, story that I wrote, which is, is a few years old now in terms of, of learning how to live love. Whenever I brought love into my work, trying it out, I then, I, I softened. I softened almost too much. And I would sit in meetings, and here I am, I'm in charge, I'm chairing the meeting, that's what I'm supposed to be doing anyway. And I just sit there and just think about how beautiful and interesting everybody was. And, and I, <laughs> I kinda, I, it's almost like I softened into not being able to move forward whenever I was only embodying love. So. It's only um, a one person company for now. It's already growing, bringing in contractors to be able to oversee other projects. And it's really, it's, um, uh, it's really surprising, if you will, of how fast things are growing. However, now is the time to be able to define these working values that are also the corporate values and use them to screen candidates to be able to work with me and also to be able to have something to hold my potential clients up to, a lens to see them through and to see if they align with my values. Uh, so thank you for watching and uh, next I'll be talking about each of the values, how they show up, how they don't show up and uh, I'm looking forward to it.